All right, I'm going to put together the Smokin' Brothers Searmate frame here. We get a lot of questions. People don't understand how to put it together. Um, I guess if you've never seen it before, it probably would be a little difficult. So I'm going to give you a real quick rundown. Um, in the package, you're going to get two long bars, like so. They've got a little bit of a lip there, as you can see. And then you're going to get two shorter bars with a lip also. So if you kind of what I do with it, if you look at the instructions, it's got the deal here with the long bar first and the long bar, the lip faces up and outside. So what I do is I just set them up like this to where that lips out there. And then these ones, the lip is going to go the opposite direction. So on this, the lip is going to go down. And so I just kind of set them here and you want the tab here to face outwards. So that one goes there. And then we got this, we got this tab and that tab is going to go here and it's going to face outward. So now you just kind of got it set up there and then you've got your, your bolts and nuts and they go underneath. So you put one in like that. And I'm just going to hand tighten it. I'm going to grab the other one. Just go in from the bottom. I'm going to hand tighten it. All right, I'm going to do the exact same thing here. So I put them in, go up from underneath. one all right that's it so now you're gonna go through and tighten them I'm not gonna tighten this one right now because this is actually a customers I'll take it back to work tomorrow and get it all tightened up but this is ultimately how you have it set up so now what you do so that's actually the bottom now we're going to flip it up to where the shorter rails, there's a lip in the front and a lip in the back. This is actually how it goes in the smoker. So we've got the grill grates here and these come in packs of three. I just got two here for the demonstration. Put them together. That's how they set in there. Third one goes here. And then this is how you get in your smoker. This is the back, this is the front. Now, the other part that confuses people is the heat waves, how to put them on. So you got these little clips here and the clips go, I put them on the side like that and like that. Okay. And I'm going to go here like that and like that. Now we take the heat waves and normal logic you would think you put the heat waves to where you put them like that, where, where that little tab goes inside. That is not what you want to do and the reason being is if you do it that way, your door will not close all the way on your Smokin' Brothers smoker. So what I do is I actually set it. So it is on the top and I slide it in like so, so that as you can see, there's a little bit of a gap there on that tab. And you do the same thing on this side. And push it out a little bit. All right, so now you can see You've got a tab there and that's what you want. So you can kind of see how I got it set up in there. So we're going to do the same thing on this side. I'm going to slide it in like so. Push it out just a smidge so this other one locks in. Right, kind of get it centered up like so. Push it in. Now you've got a tab on each side. 
See, there's a tab. So now when you put it in your smoker, this is the back, this is the front. So when you're looking at it in your smoker, it's gonna look just like this. And so I'll show you what it looks like in the smoker. Mine is dirty because I just used it. It's not in that smoker. There we go. So as you can see, I've got the tabs there. And the reason being is up here you have this lip. So when you close the lid, that lid is allowed to close. If you put your heat wave where it sits, where this sits inside the heat wave, your lid will stay open. You will not get the right temps. So put it just like that. Put it in your smoker. You're good to go. I usually run it about 400 degrees on my steaks. Eight minutes aside makes the perfect steak. So hopefully that helps you with your Smoking Brothers Searmate and Heat Wave setup.